Now, government over the years has made a lot of program for poverty alleviation for removing poverty in our country. Initially, when the uh, plans were five year plans were made, not much emphasis was given because it was uh, supposed that if we we'll, uh, give develop give uh, more stress on the development of the country, if we we'll establish more industries, people will get employment, they'll have income, and then the problem of poverty will automatically be solved. But something like this has not happened. The economy has grown, but the effect has not trickled down to the lower section of the society. So then it was realized that we need to have special programs which should be focusing on removal of poverty. So we can say the government had divided into three phases. Now the government had not divided it into three phases. The growth of the um, programs that have been taken up can be divided into three phases. In the first phase, from first to fourth plan, more emphasis was on. Uh, setting up industries and they thought that it will go down well but from fifth plan onwards they had more made they had made programs which are more centered on removing of poverty and then eighth plan onwards they had become special schemes they had launched for their poverty alleviation the schemes that recently have been wrong launched as one is manarega which is very famous it is mahatma gandhi rural employment guarantee scheme which was launched in the year 2006 it is a scheme that has been launched for unskilled laborers it was guaranteed 100 days of employment was guaranteed to them so that they have they can earn and it is for unskilled labor workers which do not have any skill and they can work in construction sites and all so 100 days of employment guarantee program was given to them then there are swarn jayanti gram swarojgar yojana yojana as the word itself suggests it is a gram swarojgar yojana gram So, uh, gram means rural areas. So, rajgar means employment scheme. So, it was like rural employment scheme. Swan Jayanti rural employment scheme. You can say Swan Jayanti Gram Swarojgar Yojana. It was made by restructuring IRDP and MWS Integrated Rural Development Program and Million Mail schemes were constituted together to form this Swan Jayanti Gram Swarojgar Yojana. which was established started in the year april 1999 and now it has been renamed as national rural livelihood missions and it is there to provide employment to skilled laborers and skilled uh, people self employment opportunities should be given to them and funds should be made available to them so that they can become their standard of living improves they have some work and they earn income so this was the gram swarojgar yojana it was made by combining irdp and mws and it has been restructured as national rural livelihood missions and it is also known as ajivika the swarn jayanti shahri rozgar yojana which was started in the year december 97 it was made by uh, combining nry nehru rozgar yojana ubsp and prime minister integrated urban employment program and it is also known as nulm which is national urban livelihood mission so nrlm is national rural livelihood mission and nulm is national urban livelihood mission these are some of the programs that have been started by government for poverty alleviation to provide employment to people so that they become employed they earn income and they come above poverty line it is therefore unskilled labor as well as uh, as well as for skill labor